Mr. President, we would like to introduce you to a suite of construction technologies that will make it possible to build the first So, I don't know how to contact Putin, but I don't know that YouTube video in English is the vector I have chosen. Now, the situation in terms is this of like... providing homes to Russian citizens <laughs> is significantly better than it was several years ago. So, they're trying However, to push this to Rostat's data. To Putin. 60% of Russian right. families are still in need of improvements and to their I know people are going to say there is a Russian version of this, you know, obviously. But I don't understand what the English translation version is doing. Yeah, maybe it's to try and, like, get other countries talking about it and being like, mm, this is pretty good shit they got over there. And then have Putin be like, mm, America saw our potential. <laughs> yeah. Like, also, wait, whoa, like him oh, it was supposed to be turnkey cities. I thought they were saying turkey cities because they're from, like, Turk <laughs> they're Turkish. And I was going to be like, oh, man, did they really misspell turkey? <laughs> no. So, basically, they're leveraging a few of their technologies here to make cities that they can build in exactly two years to solve Russia's housing crisis. And I guess they're doing it in English, so if one day he happened to be talking to Obama about something, like, Obama would be like, by the way, did you hear about this turnkey city thing? And Putin would be like, oh, wait a sec, I think I saw that in my recommended videos. <laughs> if I have learned anything from the Olympics, it's that hasty construction in Russia <laughs> is great <laughs> modern construction technology makes it possible to so, get only bare walls but yeah basically uh, this is like a little potpourri of some of the other the the here in shot videos yeah, greatest hits yeah <laughs> and seismically secure buildings of up to yeah, and seismically secure by the way so you hopefully won't need the the, the safety bed i mean they're still but, in every room right of we made them this is a courtesy they're there i mean they <laughs> <laughs> they have them on surplus, yeah. And the idea is uh, they can build one whole city in two years. They don't explain how, with a housing crisis, like, people will pay for their new houses or anything. I think there's a bit of a misunderstanding of what a housing crisis a lot of times means. <laughs> yeah! Because, like, there's housing crises in some areas with a lot of abandoned houses, but, like... That's not always... No. And it's, you know, it's funny is I feel like some of these solutions are like come from maybe like an episode of ALF they saw or something like that. Like there, there was an episode where ALF becomes president and he says like, I gave the homeless job or the unemployed jobs building homes for the homeless. And it's like, ha ha ha, little sitcom joke. But the here in shots like, wait, that could work. Wait. Maybe Alf is on to something. <laughs> Not to get too far off here, but if you have a chance to just hit random page on the Alf wiki and read it, it's pretty awesome. There is a lot of oddly specific Alf knowledge in the world. For the record, like you can learn about like Alf's one cousin this one time, a thing that happened and how that happens to work with some character. It's awesome. I... Sorry. It, it's like Sonic lore, but it's Alf. So. <laughs> I understand. Ah, you can build houses out of these shitty peas or this hay bale. <laughs> this is my favorite part, too, where they're like, whatever you have in your country, we can use as material to build fast, cheap houses. It hair? Does not Just human matter. hair. If you have lots of that. <laughs> Let's grow some houses, baby. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> Cut Corn your hair. <laughs> cut, cut your hair, young man. Do you want to get a job? Cocaine? No, mom. Get in a house. A building constructed <laughs> using our technology will thus be much less expensive than one built using other known methods. So do now, they not realize that you need, like, equipment to lift things up and put them down? <laughs> like, it's not like... It's not like SimCity or something. You don't just, like, have no, things they... descend from the... Is this, like, going to be... Oh, no. I got it. The quadcopters. Mm -hmm are going to yep. come in, right, and just drop down pieces on top. <laughs> to, to answer your question, do they realize you can do that? The answer is a most definitely no. I mean, I don't even know how you get this modular roof onto the modular building. Like, the walls I sort of maybe understand. <laughs> And then, and then here's your breakdown. We don't need a spreadsheet when we have Photoshop. Do you have to space everything evenly and nice? Nah. Just here's a, it on. Here's another thing, too, is like, you know what they forgot? Mm -hmm. Labor? 
<laughs> you know what, like, the most expensive part about building houses, just building anything, always ends up being? It's what labor. <laughs> it's almost always labor. Oh, man, look at that. Look at these. Ruby roofs, gold roofs. Fucking, we got it, baby. Architectural <laughs> variety, like this garbage or this piece of shit. <laughs> Uh, oh, what yes. the hell is the Escher house? Welcome to the Michelin Mansion. <laughs> <laughs> and like, it's like all these beautiful facades or anything, but it's like, I thought we were talking about a housing crisis. It's not like you're, let's show all these people beautiful condos and shit that they can't afford. Possibly. Thanks to the large variety of balconies and panels, we can build... <laughs> is, P is Putin supposed to still be watching this? Uh, yeah, like, whoa. Wait a minute. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm glad that Putin's like, you know, he's like, uh, I'm not really feeling this. And he sees a little wood Viking ship on a kid's playground. He's like, oh, shit. <laughs> Is that a pirate ship? Oh, fuck. <laughs> and Putin's like, I've always wanted cities that are shaped like this. Just weird fucking circles plastering the goddamn landscape. If I learned anything in metallurgy and crystallography... There is no shape more efficient than a circle for packing. <laughs> no wasted space, baby. Give me that circle. They stay stack perfectly together. Now, can I point out, by the way, another way they have to contact Putin or have Putin contact them, besides this fake-ass basketball game, is that they just have a Gmail account linked right in the description. <laughs> cool. Mr. President, just email us here. We made this temp account real quick. Same way to avoid traffic jams. There's an automated underground shipping line. Man, is that all I gotta do? Can I just make a YouTube video that's just like, Bill Gates, look, <laughs> look, pal. Have you heard of this Let's Play stuff? <laughs> Let me show you my proposal, and then it just cuts to like a video of like a jar of mayonnaise for six hours or something. It's just like. Mm? <laughs> <laughs> oh wait look what happened here. oh my god yes 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 bringing it back it's the callback dude totally <laughs> oh my god yes oh my god it's like the final episode it's like the final chapter of a good video game man you see everything come together so beautifully <laughs> and then the last minute will be like by the way how's your military <laughs> mr putin check this shit out and then it just shows a quadcopter destroying the whole city <laughs> <laughs> this is what's gonna happen if you don't write to the Gmail in the description right now. <laughs> I don't want to threaten anybody, but have you seen some of the quadcopters we have? We build entire micro neighborhoods on a turnkey basis with all infrastructure. They keep saying turnkey. Mm -hmm. Um. <laughs> yes. You know what? No, that's it. I just wanted to make sure everyone noticed that. <laughs> Maybe do a Google later. Oh man, shit, you can see some of the houses are like having frame rate issues. <laughs> Mr. President, if you could get us a GTX 1080 or two of them SLI'd, that'd be sick. Thanks. Here at Dehirian Chat, we're still using a Mac 2. You can, if you could send it to the Hotmail below, we didn't set up two factor authentication for that yet. <laughs> Yes, please email me a GPU. Thanks. <laughs> the high reliability of monolithic apartment building construction. The reliability of construction is what else? <laughs> yeah, I like where there was the part. Um, I don't know. They've kind of been a whirlwind tour of bullshit, but they just like had this like huge mold that they poured bullshit in and then immediately pulled it off. And they're like, look at that. It's set instantly. It's like, I'm sorry. What material do you expect me to build a home out of that will last reliably forever that sets immediately? <laughs> oh, and by the way, here's your logo. <laughs> is is the hierarchy? I mean, I'm not a doctor, but like that seems, hmm, I'm going to have to check that afterwards. <laughs> So the way this works is we're just under the president. Decisions will be made uh -huh. by the Department of Presidential Affairs, thereby eliminating the possibility of corruption and bureaucratic... Oh, that's going to eliminate the chance of corruption in Russian politics. <laughs> <laughs> oh, apologies to any Russian viewers, but a lot of your systems are very corrupt. <laughs> no, I think they know. I, 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 I don't know. think they'd be like, oh, well, <laughs> I don't know. How dare you dislike... 
Let me just blog about how much Retsu Prey hates the Russians. <laughs> I heard he said our hats were dumb. <laughs> I never said that. I ne no, no. <laughs> no. I mean, they are. Look, what? Uh, those what? buildings are dumb. <laughs> yeah. Who the hell wants to build something like Here's that? Here's how we're going to really efficiently buy a <laughs> use space by building a... Building that's like a balls on bottom and a cock on top, so it takes up all this ground space, and then has a tiny tower extending up the middle. <laughs> that's efficiency, baby. Here's some stock photos we found on the internet, by the way. Also, I think a lot wasn't part of it saying like they were having issues of space and like how they needed to keep stuff tight and compact. <laughs> what do you know about Russian geography? What's the first thing that comes to mind when I say Russia? Is it small landmass? <laughs> yeah, um, let's see. There's not that one. <laughs> Are you sure? Because I'm pretty sure that's what to hear in chats out here to solve is the small amount of land in Russia. <laughs> There's not much. Mr. Mr. President, these could be your families. <laughs> Holy crap. They really believe in themselves to just post that fucking phone number here. <sighs> wow. I wonder if Putin's going to go for it. To hear in chat. Thank you, Mr. President. <laughs> I think he honestly thinks Putin's going to like be like browsing YouTube. Like, I can't solve the housing crisis. Well, I'll watch a Let's Play of PewDiePie and then, oh, hey, wait a sec. What the hell? Appeal to the president. Tell me more. Also, he would just assume that on YouTube in English, the appeal to president <laughs> is him <laughs> and not, you know, Obama. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I don't understand, too, about the here in shot. They must have paid for translation at some point, right? Like, or maybe they have a narrator friend or something, but. God. Jeez. They're in key cities, dude. Yeah, no, I, uh. <laughs> good luck, good luck with all that. <laughs>